And I've been counting days to get away Welcome back to my channel, it's Tanisha here. So one of my followers asked me to do a hairstyle video when I posted this picture and I'll insert it right here. So if you'd like to see how I achieved that hairstyle, then keep on watching. Okay, so what you'll need, basically, in order to achieve this hairstyle, you'll need some gel, a comb, just to do whatever parting you need to do, a lot of hairpins, and a brush. And that's it. Now let's get jumping. So yeah, just those four items you'll need in order to achieve this hairstyle. So let's jump in. All right, guys. So I'm starting off on an old wash and go, as you could see. So now I'm just gonna pull out some tendrils. I just had some hair hanging down to the back on both sides of my head. So now you'll just see me separate those that I'll deal with later on. I'm gonna go in with some gel now and just gel the back of my hair and then I'm gonna go in with the brush and brush my hair up so that it is really smooth and really sleek. Being careful not to pull the tendrils up in when I'm brushing my hair as well. So then I'm just going in with a hair clip and just gonna put that in place to keep the back of my hair up. And that'll be the base and the start of how this updo will turn out. So I made a part on the right side of my head as you can see. So now I'm just going to take some gel and gel back that right part of my hair. The right side of my hair as you can see right now. And I'm just going to go in and pull out a tendril as you would have seen in the picture. That I had a tendril out on my right side. I didn't bother to pull out any on the left side just because that's where my bangs would be falling. So I'm going to go in with another bobby pin again. As I said you're going to need a lot of those. So it's just secure your hair as best as you would be able to with as many bobby pins as you need for this hairstyle. So right now I'm just taking out the front portion of my hair and these are gonna be my bangs that I'm gonna deal with later on so I'm just taking them out of the way. So now to deal with the next side of my hair, I'm going to get some more gel and just kind of paste that onto my hair and brush it in so that that part of my hair is also sleek as well. Like I said, you're going to need a lot of hairpins, so take another hairpin and pin that side up again, making sure it's as secure as you need it to be. So once you have your hair situated, you're just gonna go now and take some additional gel and just fix your tendrils the way you like them. I like to finger coil mine, especially um, on this part of my hair because it's a little bit looser than the rest of my hair. So I just finger coil that. But you could just put gel or however you typically define your curls, you could go ahead and do that at this point. Now you could basically decide if you want to take down tendrils or even you could just put all of your hair up. It really is customizable to your personal style and preference. So now onto my bangs. I'm just gonna take some extra gel and put that on my bangs. As I said, this is an old wash and go, so I just wanted to reactivate the products and redefine my curls as best as I can. So 
So I'm going in with even more gel and just gelling that part of my hair down and taking an additional um, hairpin and just pinning that down because that part of my hair tends to be really poofy so I just wanted to lay it down a little bit. So there we have the hairstyle. It's really cute, really simple, and as you can see, I'm really feeling myself right now. I'm just gonna turn around and let you guys see what the hairstyle looks like from the back. And as you can see, my curls are really fine. The hairstyle is really, really cute, guys. So this is a two-in-one hairstyle. You can completely change the look of this hairstyle by just pinning your bangs up and that gives you a different look. So if you don't like hair in your face, you can opt for that alternative. This is a really cute and easy hairstyle. I really enjoyed making this for you guys and I hope you liked how it turned out. So yeah, this is a really quick and easy hairstyle. It probably took me all of five minutes to put together. You could dress it up, put a little flower, a little um, hair accessory, make it really cute for date night, for church, for a wedding. You could dress it up, dress it down, depending on your occasion. But it's one of my go-tos, especially when my hair starts to get old from whatever hairstyle I had it in previously. But yeah, like I said, really quick, really easy. And these little tendrils just help to dress it up a little more, I think. So yeah, if you like this hairstyle and you like this video, do a thumbs up. Comment down below and let me know what you think about the hairstyle. If you do try it out, do tag me on Instagram at Naturally Nishi. I'd love to see how it turns out. And also, don't forget to subscribe, share the video with a friend. And don't forget to hit the notification bell so you know every time I post a new video. Thank you so much for watching guys and I'll see you in the next one. Bye.